EFC Africa 08 is proudly brought to you by Muscle Farm, the athlete's company. Juan Potts versus Obatobi Bagon. Obatobi Bagon from the DRC Kinshasa Sledgehammer. That's all I can say, he's carrying Sledgehammer. It's a big, big, big unit, CS. Double gold medal winner at the Abu Dhabi Africa Trials. You don't go 11 and 0 without having a lot of skills. The fight is only magazine tail of the tape. Well, the height advantage of two centimeters for Bagon and a massive reach advantage, seven centimeters. This is a heavyweight fight. You don't want to miss over to Gordon Laws. Ladies and gentlemen, this bout is three rounds in the EFC Africa heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut. He stands 1,9 meters tall and weighs in at 109 kilograms. Fighting out of Kinshasa, DRC, Obutobe, Begon! And now, introducing his opponent, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist holding a perfect record of 11 wins with zero losses. He stands 1,88 meters tall and weighs in at 109 kilograms. Fighting out of Cape Town, Ruan Faint Pots! And when the action begins, your referee is Vickers Swart. Well, our gorgeous EFC girls, that's Ina. Proudly brought to you by Sondach. The EFC girls looking absolutely fantastic yet again. Guys, if you can keep the fight clean, keep them at all times, touch gloves. Take out your corner. Little wry smile from Bagon. You ready? Could that okay, let's mean? fight. He's up for this fight. Here we go, it's the heavyweights. Potts against Bagon. Yeah, the crowd is already expecting a knockout here. Just wait for Bagon to explode, it seems. Yeah, Potts is very weary. Yeah, he doesn't know what to expect. He hasn't found any YouTube videos. He doesn't know what this that guy could bring. the most dangerous opponent. He's the guy that you can't find any tape on. He's unpredictable. You, you honestly don't know what to expect. Well, Makishi urging Bagon to do something. Crowd getting crowd, impatient. Crowd getting involved as well. like a low blow that Ron caught him with there. Bagon ready to just continue, doesn't want to take his five minutes. Could be interesting, we don't know what to expect from Bagon. Will he explode, will he wait for Potts to come? Yeah, Potts' is, uh, Potts is mind must be in exactly the same place ours is right now, CS. Big oh. leg, he, goes, he gets caught with the right. Whoa. Bit of a side kick by Ron Potts. But he got tagged with that right, and he, he could did. see a little smile he on Bagon's oh, oh, big man. body kick. But again, as he comes in to kick, Bagon is, is loading up at right, and he landed it for a second time. Two massive units battling it out at EFC Africa 08. This is two big guys. Just takes one killer blow, and it's game over. Comes to the inside, and again, Bagon swings wild with that right. Wonder why Ruan is still going and with the, or opting to go for the leg kicks. Oh, he gets tagged again. Now it's in the clinch. This is his wall. It's the Muay Thai game. This is where Ruan Potts is very, very comfortable. He's got the underhook. Bagon's got that over under on the on the left hand side. Ruan going for the foot stomps. Oof, those are horrible. Wearing away. Bagon is those foot stomps. A lot of fighters actually have a sort of a, a verbal gentleman's agreement beforehand that there's going to be no foot stomps from either guy. Just because it's such a silly injury, you break the bones on the top of your foot and you can be out for quite some time. Ron Potts uh, pulling guard. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. 
Ron big frame to have on top of you. <laughs> very, very big. And Ron landing the shots to the back of the head, trying to get, uh, trying to sweep Bag on. Bagon sort of just holding on. There's no space between him and at the moment. Taking the punishment, isn't he? That's any heavy punishment, but it's annoying. See, Ron Potts is uh, screaming at the referee. What's he going to do? Stand his back up. Bagon is literally just lying there taking shots to the body. He's not doing anything. Now Potts is wailing away at the, that short rib of, of Bagon's. Bagon, unfazed. Surely they've got to stand up here. Yeah, the referee has to stand him up here. Like there's, there's, you know, Rowan Potts is landing shots from the bottom, but this is not doing anything, and this is not going to change the course of the fight. So they're speaking to Bagon. Oh, and Rowan Potts sweeps him over in full mount. Oh, oh the oh, elbow. Nice elbow on the outside. Bagon's oh, in trouble. big elbows. Bagon's this is going to get finished quickly. Ground and pound at its best from Potts. Ron Potts is landing shot after oh, big wow. elbows, two massive, massive elbows. Referee having a close look, he's warning him he's going to stop it. Steps over. in and he stops it. Ruan bangs Potts. Too good. Oh, but two men bang on. This is where you set up that sweep. That is very, very nicely done. Gets a sweep and uh, straight into full mount. From there it was one way traffic, landing punch after punch after punch. Fantastic display by, by Ruan Potts. And uh, this could very well give him the heavyweight title, or the shot at the heavyweight title, rather. Well, we'll have to wait and see if he's done enough to convince the EFC, but there's some devastating power from Ruan Potts. Finishing off his opponent from the DRC. W is his. Gordon Law standing by. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting the winner of this bout by way of TKO, three minutes, 54 seconds into round number one, Ruan Pan!